Okay, in this video tutorial, I'm going to show you how to get back deleted files. Uh, I know there's a lot of videos out there that takes 10 to 15 minutes long. I'm going to try to make this one under 5 minutes and show you just only what you have to know uh, to get back any deleted files from any kind of a device and no matter what kind of file it is. So that should sum that up pretty good. Now first you will have to download this software. It's uh, You can see the link here in my address bar or you can just click the link under this video in the description box and it will take you straight to the page. Um, just click the free download button and you can see here that this is a Microsoft partner company and they're also accredited to business with the Better Business Bureau so it is a very legit company um, they are highly recommended and also a lot of computer shops uses this software to recover files for uh, clients all over the world so it is very very good software and it's one of the most affordable you'll find anywhere now this is a free download what that means is you can download this software it will scan your computer or any device you have hooked up to your computer for files that it can recover and it will show you exactly what those files are before you do purchase it which I believe is like forty dollars um, they usually have a coupon code so when you buy it just make sure that is offered so at least you can save another ten dollars or so um, but I want to go ahead and show you exactly what the software is and how it works so once you download the software and install it this is the screen that's going to come up and you'll see here there's a few options. There's a quick scan, a full scan, and a guided scan. Um, basically, these allow you to scan from different types of devices. The guided scan also allows you to um, recover items from a formatted drive or even from an existing partition, recover emails, or recover items from an external device such as iPods, digital cameras. Uh, basically, it'll recover any kind of file from any kind of a device. But what I usually do is I just go to the Advanced tab and I will select which device I want to choose here to recover files from. Um, this here is my main hard drive and these are some external drives I have and these are some uh, USB drives I have. I'm just going to leave this one selected for now. As you can see here that it does recover files from different types. <clears throat> And so what you do is you just select which one you want to cover files from. I always keep these four boxes checked because I've had to use the software multiple times for external drives, USB drives, SD cards, you name it, I've had to use it because I'm just really bad about accidentally deleting files uh, or even files just disappearing for no reason at all. And so uh, once you select what you want to recover, click Start Scan it's going to go through and it's going to tell you how many items it finds right here and it's also going to organize all these files into independent folders so you can see which files um, it's able to find and if you hit the plus signs on any of these it's going to break it down and show you what those files are before you recover them which is something that's really good about the free download version because many of the software tools out there they don't give you this option you you actually have to buy the software first to even find out if it works or if it can recover your files and if it doesn't you're just out of luck and so with this software you download the free version and then it's going to scan it's going to show you if it, if it can recover the files you're wanting and then once it finds those files I'm going to go ahead and stop it you can see it found over a thousand files already um, down here it's going to ask you where you want it to save all these recovered files from and you can choose to recover these files at any kind of a location whether it's an external hard drive a USB drive or on your computer desktop uh, or your laptop or whatever you're using uh, you just choose a location here and you want to click recover and if you haven't purchased the software yet it's going to ask you to register it and it's going to redirect you to purchase it which I think is around forty dollars like I said normally there's like a ten dollar off coupon make sure you look for that when you uh, do purchase Purchase it. It should be available. They usually always have it on there because uh, I buy a lot of products from this company just because I like them so well. Um, but really, that's all there is to it. Once you uh, purchase it, it's going to bring you back and you just enter your license code and then it will allow you to click recover and you'll have all your files back. So it's really that easy. If you have the right software like this one, the process is, is just flawless. Um, you know, you're not going to have all that stress and frustration you have was as you do with many of the other software tools out there um, that just seem to lack in a lot of features and options and, and recovering files and so really that's all there is to it um, and I, I just wish you guys the best in getting back your deleted files